Chief Imam of uh, All India Imam Organization, Umair Ahmed al has been given Y plus security cover. This after the Imam was threatened following his meeting with the RSS Chief Mohan Bhagwat. And during that meeting that happened last month, Imam al had called Bhagwat as Rashtrapita, drawing ayah from the radicals as well. But thereafter, he said that he has been receiving threat calls from there and from abroad taking uh, asking him to take back his words and to apologize or to face dire consequences let's first listen in to the chilling threats that the imam had received because he continues to say that he will not back down from his comment that he made despite the threats he and his family has been receiving नहीं मेरे बीच से क्या होगी नहीं होगी मुझे इन सब बात से डर नहीं लगता ना मैं किसी के डर में आता हूं ना मुझे किसी का थ्रेट है नहीं मैं गुलाम हूं या मैं कुछ भी हूं मुझे मैं आपसे डरने वाला नहीं हूं मुझे देश भर से कुछ भी बोलो so in the police complaint that had been filed by Imam al Yasi, he stated that his objective of meeting Mohan Bhagwat was to send a message of peace and to strengthen national unity. So thanking the government for upgrading his security cover, the Imam said that such threats will not deter him and he will continue to con take his stand as far as his message of peace is concerned. तीसरा फोन मेरे पास दुबई से आता है उसकी बंगाल की एफआईआर भी हो गई है अब उसके साथ तीसरी एफआईआर आज दुबई की हुई है जिस पे भी सेम इसी तरह का उन्होंने का कहना है साफ कहना है कि आप माफी मांगेंगे और आपको अपने शब्द वापस लेने पड़ेंगे मैं अपने शब्दों को वापस नहीं लेने वाला इसके लिए सर तन से जुदा कर दें मेरा परिवार को खत्म कर दें मुझे जान से मार दें मैं पीछे हटने वाला बिल्कुल नहीं हूं जी मेरे पास पहले वाई वाई कैटेगरी की सुरक्षा थी वाई श्रेणी उसको उन्होंने वाई प्लस कर दिया है तो मुझे लगता है कि भारत सरकार ने अपना असेसमेंट जो किया है अपने तौर पे जो करती है सरकार वो उनका काम है well, Imam Ilyasi leads the biggest organization of imams in the world, having over half a million imams in India as its members. So the irony is that a top imam who is trying to improve the interfaith relations is being threatened. And this has led to this security cover being increased. But on the other hand, there's no end to the chilling beheading calls that are also being issued in different parts of the country, almost as if there is zero fear of law. Let me straight away go across to Ishwarya now because Ishwarya, we've heard the videos. In fact, what uh, the Imam himself has released of how he's been getting threatening calls, not just from the country, but also from abroad as well. But he is uh, continuously taking a stand that he will not bow before such radical uh, ideas and beliefs. Oh, well, in fact, uh, 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 you know, these threats uh, were received uh, by Eliasi after RSS Chief Mohan Bhagwat visited his mosque and also uh, Madarsa. And uh, there were several calls that were made from international uh, uh, phone calls and also uh, from India as well. And uh, clearly stated that these visits of RSS Chief Mohan Bhagwat to his mosque and Madrasa was just to spread the peace across the communities and this has been also welcomed from several other Imams but there are several sections of society uh, which do not want uh, you know such things to happen and therefore he was receiving life threat and now uh, you know when uh, uh, the MHA has uh, uh, you know uh, now, now uh, have uh, increased his security and has been enhanced to Y plus from Y security he's been welcoming this but clearly uh, his uh, uh, threats uh, which have been received which he has been received receiving after RSS chief Mohan Bhagwat's visit is continuing and he has been uh, clearly thanking MHA as far as the security enhancement of his is concerned uh, that uh, he uh, will remain firm on his statement. He called, uh, remember, RSS Chief Mohan Bhagwat as uh, uh, Mahatma and, uh, 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 and, and you know, Rashtrapita and also, uh, you know, uh, uh, Mohan Bhagwat as Rashtrapita, I beg your pardon, and also he continues to do so. Uh, he clearly stated that he it was personal comment it was not uh, uh, you know uh, what what uh, you know each and every individual should do he uh, clearly respects RST chief Mohan Bhagwan and therefore the reason perhaps uh, you know uh, a lot of section of society does not want uh, uh, you know such statements uh, and therefore the reason he is receiving the life threats. Okay all right Ashwarya thank you for joining us so with those details 